Why does privacy matter to a networking professional? Now, a lot of people would say that technology, you know, firewalls, security, routers, switches, network paths, zipsec, MPLS, privacy has got nothing to do with it. And yet, I will keep telling you that privacy has everything to do. And the reason is, is that you need to understand what's happening in the industry around you to be able to deliver value to the businesses that you, you are the customers of. A professional, as a career professional, is the business that you work for. You sell them your services, they give you money. Your employer, your, you know, you are a salary slave, but you get paid in, re in return for your work. And understanding the environment in which the business around you operates helps you to understand what sort of value you can deliver to your employer. So you need to know the need for privacy, the need to prevent a network from being insecure is what's driving people to implement TLS 1.3. TLS 1.3 will make all forms of network interception fundamentally unviable. You won't be able to use IDSs anymore without some sort of machine learning on top to look for patterns in data flow. You can't look inside the packets and then see the HTTP data. TLS security is the only valid validated and tested. We want security mechanisms that are valid and tested. And so we're moving to HTTPS for all of our security so that we can take advantage of TLS 1.2 and 1.3, which has a whole bunch of eyes on the code, right? So you need to be aware of this and to be able to explain why your purpose of firewalls is going away. Firewalls don't work anymore when the only two things going through your firewall is DNS and HTTP. There's no point. The original idea of firewalls was to say, I want to control access to my HTTP, to my mail servers, to my FTP servers. I want to restrict access for finger and SIP if we're in where I do connect connectivity and stuff. But increasingly, as all those protocols disappear into HTTP, a basic L4 protocol um, firewall is pointless. You need L7. And increasingly, even L7 firewalls are pointless because the encryption prevents them from being useful. Korea, you need to be able to tell that story to the people around you, even if they don't know. A lot of security professionals haven't quite caught on to this idea. They're still so busy with their head down and stroking their ponytails while they futz with their security policies that they're not seeing what happens in the world around. Discussions like what Facebook is doing, what telcos are doing to sell your data off to other people are things that you need to be thinking about. I'm Greg Farrow from The Packet Pushers. If you like this, please hit the button below and subscribe. A thumbs up would be nice. And if you want more like this, head on over to packetpushers.net where you can subscribe to a whole bunch of fine free technical podcasts. And they're really quite extraordinary, honest.